All right, so my next contract is way out here outside the city at this house down the road here. And it's called Lord of the Wood. I'm assuming, my assumption is we have to fight that badass legend dude. Maybe if we're lucky, it's the same guy I found earlier. I can just murder him, call it a day. Cunny of the goose. Yep. Cunny of the goose, 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 goose. <sighs> Got the shivers. <laughs> That's right, girl. What up, Brian Hotch? Welcome, Master Witcher. Saw your notice. Saw the notice. Let's say I'm interested. That's good. Grand even. Name's Breen Hotch. I posted that slip. Gonna need details. Course, course. Well, through a series of regrettable events, I came to own a spread of forest ripe for logging, near Novigrad. At a distance from any roads, but quite near the port. Easy gold, right? Just hire some lumberjacks and count the coin. Meant details about the monster, not your business. Oh, it's all linked, see? I took on some dwarven loggers, but they came to me, claiming the forest haunted. Thought them lazy, nothing more. Then one day, they went in the wood, and only one returned. Said some forest devil had attacked him. Oh boy. I'll handle it. I'll take the job. This logger, where'll I find him? Arund. <laughs> Last I saw him, he was drinking away his pay. Said he had to honor his dead comrades. And welcome, traveler. Drink with me, you cocksucker. Fucking knock back a few so as my mates will race peaceful. Something plowed them up good, but I don't know what it was. Don't know who or what to curse. Talk to one Breen Hotch. Told me all about your comrade's death. No blicker. We tried to explain some horror was prowling in the forest. He refused to believe it. Well, it just so turns out I'm tracking said monster. He's hired me. Wants me to find the beast that attacked you and your friends. Is that so? Well, I take back what I said. Good man, Breen. Though a halfling. Tell me about the attack. What do you remember? Yeah, we were making our way out of the forest. Loaded with wood like pack horses. All of a sudden we heard a bloody howl. Like a wolf's. Pack leaders. We legged it, but then the cartwheel was stuck. Magnus wrecked a holler that she would run to the hut for the crossbows. So I ran. Come back to the woods. Bloody plow and massacre. Couldn't tell me mates apart. Thanks. Really helpful, that. Kill the bugger. Will you? <laughs> this drunk right here. Yep, all right. <laughs> Perfect. Logger's hut. Need to find the spot where they died. Okay, so here's the cart tracks. Deep ruts. Logger's wagon must have stopped here. Then they went down this road. Probably towards their clearing. Mm -hmm. Follow the ruts. How crazy is it that I've been here before? Just to explore, and then now this is actually for a thing. And if I would have gone this way, I would have ended up... Mm, I would have ended up in some real trouble. But for now, we're good. Hey, fellas. He tried to dodge. Guy tried to dodge. So if there are what Neckers now, here... You there's definitely corpses. Yep. Alright, so we'll let them do their own thing over there. I'm gonna continue to follow this. Can I? There was a fight here. Two dwarves and something big. 
So we got footsteps. A dwarf went this way. And blood. Lots of blood. Wounded dwarf tried to flee, bleeding heavily. So we have a wounded dwarf and then this guy going this way. So let's go this way. What happened to this dude? Do you hear anything? I hear a lot of things, but... All right, we have this guy. Roots pinned this one to the ground. So hard he suffocated. Damn. Roots pinned this one to All the right, ground. So, so hard he suffocated. We know what happened to that guy. His friend ended up further in the woods and is just... Wrecked. Blood, blood. Oh shit. Deep wound on his back. Bled to death. Okay, well, I found both of them. What else do I need? Ah, uh, here we go. Claude the Rock. Must have been angry and strong. Everything says Leshen, a young one. Must have arrived here recently. Need to find its totem. Crows serve lessons. Should find some near the totem. Ah, uh, okay. Kernan is his name. And thus we will kill him. Look for crows in the sky, maybe? Hold on. Ooh, I hear him. Well, hey there. Not a lessons, birds. False trail. Boohoo! Thought I had something. So, if I triangulate where the two guys died, right, it would be this way? Not the other way, because that's sort of back. I don't know. Look, I'm just guessing. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Hmm. Ordinary ravens looks like. No sign of a totem. Total failure. All right. So it's probably deeper in the woods, then. It's probably way over here. Probably this one back here. Oh, shit. There's certainly a lot of them. Let's uh, brace ourselves for whatever's about to come here. That's a totem! A Leshen's totem. Now, to destroy it, ought to piss it off, make it leave its lair. Like this? <laughs> no. No. What about this? Oh, that'll do. Hey, pal! You here? Shit. Oh shit, look at that thing. Those are horrifying. Oh my god. Those are horrifying. Okay, forest spirits. Let's uh. Oh my god. Oh my god. You feel like fire? Might be his thing, right? Whoa! Ow, shit. His crows. Do damage. Oh, Jesus! His crows do damage! He's using nature against me. What an asshole. Oh, God! This is not pleasant. We'll use this, and we'll use this guy as hard as we can. And avoid his crows. Woo! Okay. Is using crows to fight me. So unlike the other one we found earlier who had wolves, this guy had crows. I love these characters. These things are all these monsters are dope. Woo! Get out the way of that. Let's set up for an igni. Burn him to the ground. Again. Roll in on him, and then we do this. Oh, shit. Wolves are in town. We got wolves. He's calling to the cavalry. All right. Well, I need to avoid all that. Did he just kill his wolf? Holy shit. He does not care at all. He does not care at all. Dude, 
don't give a damn about his friends. Oh my god, and that's why you lose. And that is why you lose this day. Whoa, shit. Get him, get him, get him, get him to swing wildly. Swing wildly, Geralt. Wrecked. <laughs> I don't know what that dance move was called at the end, but that was awesome. Black unicorn. What? Um, what is the weapon the black unicorn called, and what does it look like? Can I just? I mean, it's not the greatest looking weapon. <laughs> That's the first time I've ever heard that one. Welcome, Master Witcher. Job's done. I killed the Leshen that attacked the Lumberjacks. Oh, that's wonderful. Grand even. I'll have to find some new loggers, but there's no shortage of folk looking for work. But can I be certain? No other lesson will show. It's possible, I suppose. I have to find a witcher if it happens. Aye, yes, yes. Well, your due reward. I'm not the kind not to pay for a job well done. Farewell. Hey, we're doing Next things. To tell me a the the Exciting. Okay. Favorite. Let's go and hit the old J and go down to the other witcher contracts. Missing brother, Oxenfurt drunk. That's in Velen. That's 33. These, I feel like, are just going to be out of my league. But I can do this one. Where do I need to go? Where do I need to go? Am I actually going to Oxenfurt? I am. That's so weird that it was not in Novigrad, though it said it was. Who am I, judge? Go back over here. Cheapest creepers. What the? <laughs> what? I was about to break out into a fight all of a sudden. I showed up in town, had to let people know what was up. Contract, the Oxford drunk. Talk to the officer. Uh, Nicholas? Hmm. Something about a drunk? Here to talk about the contract. Contract? Ah, yes. Put my mark to something of the sort. Seems a creature's attacking lonely passers-by, abandoning their corpses in gutters around Oxenfurt. Isn't that something you should look into? Perhaps, but we've a plow in war to win. Haven't got the time to clean gutters. I'll do it, sure. I'll take the job. Need to hear some details. You'll learn everything I know. All right, tell me about the victims. Like to examine the victims' bodies. A corpse is a corpse. I see the wounds might be able to tell what kind of monster killed them. Ask our sawbones. He'll know if the corpses have been burned or not. You'll most likely find him in the hut on the riverbank. Our impromptu morgue. Any witnesses? Any witnesses to these attacks? Anyone see the beast? Some woman survived an attack. They say she's not been sober since. I'd try the tavern in Oxenfurt if you're willing to try talking to her. Won't give me any trouble with the reward, will you? Nah, I want this out of my hair. <laughs> okay. So first, let's go to the tavern. Talk to the drunk. It's daytime, she can't be that drunk. And then we'll go over here and talk to the medic. So let's go here first. Oh. Will you buy a round for a victim of the beast? Let's talk about this beast, shall we? Tell me about the monster. How you were attacked. I'd need another bottle to get through it. Ain't nobody got time for that! Magic, do your thing! Besides, I need a sober story. 
I think you'll tell me everything I need to know, bottle or no bottle. Yes, I will. Damn right you will. I was leaving the inn that night. Might have had a drink or five. But I'm sure I wasn't hallucinating. Something down an alley called my name. It was dark. I couldn't see what it was, but it wasn't no human. Of that I'm certain. What makes you so sure? I just know. This thing grabbed the enemy's skirt, but I broke free and ran. That it? You didn't see much. Don't believe me either, do you? Fuck you! Fuck you all! Whoa! What's this? Where, where'd that guy come from? What's this? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't know. You're the one who popped up. You the medic? I'd like to see the monster's victims. Oh, yes. I've not had them burned yet. Must get to that. Uh, <laughs> you examine them? You've done autopsies yet? Intend to? Why would I? Beggars and vagrants. Every last one stinking of cheap wine. Mind if I have a look? In point of fact, I'd prefer you didn't sniff around. Gonna make me come back with a written order? Good grief. Pushy, aren't we? Here, the key to the morgue. Look all you want. Oh, I will. Oh, I will. Stitch red to red, yellow to yellow, and white to white. Okay, so this guy... He was drunk. Someone dragged him over the cobblestones. Fang marks on his neck. Vampire sucked his blood. Yep, we got a vampire. Oh, boy. Okay, what about this guy? Vampire bites in the strong stench of alcohol, just like the other one. Mm, examine the site. So, a vampire who goes after drunks? The witch hunters will see to you. Arms for the poor. Do you know anything, sir? I don't see anything. Where does this attack take place? Around the corner here? Whoa! Did you hear that? The bracelet, pretty worn. Silver under the gilding, too big for a woman's wrist. Attacker lost it most likely. Fondness for jewelry, wounds on the victim's bodies. Everything suggests a catacan, except this vampire likes the blood of drunkards. That's the way to lure it out. Okay, well, you know what we gotta do. Get shit face. <laughs> Let's do this. Just you wait. The witch hunters Oh, I remember you. What'll it be? What up, Stepjin? I need a drink. Wanna get drunk off my ass, and it's gotta be on cheap wine. Trouble with the lass? Or did your enterprise go under? Neither. Just part of the job. I'll need you to pay in advance. Much like when I live stream, it's for my job. Poor. Poor. And keep it coming. <laughs> I love it. This is my plan. Okay, well, this might not have been the best plan. Can I? I can't do that now. Terrific. Once was it made from Vicar Varro. Tight at night, she'd be loose tomorrow. Early in the morning. Where am I going? Vicovaro, <laughs> cloud with pleasure, drank with sorrow. Till early in the morning. Catacan didn't hear it. I'll try another verse. Oh, down this way. Well, I have. Had a great deal to drink. When I am drunk in the third person, you know you've had a lot to drink. Disease, defeatism and desertion. Hello? Our third maid was not demanding. Gave it up to any man standing early in the morning. What's the meaning of this? Such rudeness and vulgarity, young people these days. All right, all right. Sheesh. 
Can I run like this? Nope. I just have to... I can use my Witcher sentences, though. Oh. Yeah, I probably should be in a main alley away from soldiers and guards and stuff like that. Right by the old barber shop. Redanian soldier who's looking the other way. Ah, uh, this could be it. I sent your blood. Come out and fight, bitch. Damn! I shall drink your blood. Come on, cut the shit. Here. Where's that? Where is here I am? Where is here? Oh my Damn god! Woo! I'm drunk and I'm still gonna kick your ass, Gale! Damned catacan. Uh oh, the chase is on. I can hear it. Oh, I'm coming for you, catacan. You can't get that far. I'm chasing your butt down, my man. I'm coming for you, Gale. I'm coming for you. to the hut by the river. Why? Is this like his chill out hut? Or does he just want to die with a view? He's just chilling in there. All right. Locked. Locked. Key required. There's a chest. With rotting flesh in it. That's locked as well. Um. Uh, there's always another way in. This place is filled with dead bodies. Hey, fella! Why you sneak out? Nope. Show me what you got. The answer, not much. Although, I haven't looted him yet, so I don't know. Ooh, key to his hideout. And his trophy. And a deer, 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 deer. Yep. And then I cut off his head. Someone's gotta. That is awesome. In every possible way. So what was the actual... The black unicorn. That's not really that great. Another, uh, what is this? 5% bonus. 5% bonus experience from monsters. Again, 10% chance to dismember is a lot of fun when dealing with humans. But, uh, yeah, you know what? 10% again. 10% still the best option I have. When you start giving me 10% to monsters, then we'll talk, game. Until then... I'm just leaving. Yeah! We're doing it. Redania. Damn thing was like right next to this dude. He did not even see it. Hmm. Are you blind? Because I killed that damn monster. Killed the monster that was murdering folk. Turns out a catacan was prowling the city. You speak true. But what on earth's a catacan? A higher vampire. Particularly interesting case, this one. How the hell could a foul beast be interesting? This one liked alcohol. Had a hugely inflated ego, too. What matters is you snuffed it out. Due some praise for that, Witcher. So long. Yay! Why is everyone threatening me? I'm doing nothing but good stuff right now. Oh my god, there's a high stakes Gwent tournament. Or, um, Gwent Old Pals, Vernon Roach. Ooh. Let's go do that really quick. 
Let's go to Vernon. And we'll win off of him. Way up here. What? Vernon's just chilling? He's just up in the city. What is that? Like the Pass of Flora? Oh, no. This is the quest with uh, Dijkstra and all of them. It's also where the High Stakes Gwent tournament is. Oh, this should be real interesting. You got brawny thighs, stranger. Mm -hmm. all right, I'll give well. you a discount for heroic deeds, but Sucks. the madam. <laughs> My eye. Nice. I wonder how much she's paid. Well, I guess if I'm people. going to do this well, Vernon thing with stuff. Dijkstra and everyone, I might as well talk to the scribe while I'm here, right? And they do, honestly. Do this high stakes wet tournament? She wiggles anymore. Chew! Yes. Yeah, I want to enter the damn tournament. How do you play for high stakes here? Firstly, we must have the proper effects. Let's have a look at our cards, shall we? Tell me they ain't the dopest. Cards are in order. But can we afford the buy-in? I don't know. 1,000? Holy shit, yeah, we can. We can. Well, let's have a name then, and we shall issue an entry ticket. Geralt of Rivia. Gerard of Rivia. The match will start soon, but the hoi polloi must first be driven out. We will please wait. Achoo! I like how we're just Vernon and Dixter and everyone else is upstairs, and we're just like, you know what? I got shit I gotta do. Deal with it. The man just vanished. Tournament participants only. Everyone else out. Achoo! We are cordially invited to come back tomorrow. So who am I going up against? Well, well. Geralt of Rivia. And I was beginning to think this tournament would be a dreadful bore. I'm afraid winning coin from peasants, thugs, and faux aristocrats is no great source of satisfaction for me. We know each other. <laughs> Let's say we've some mutual acquaintances. I've heard many good things about you. In vivid detail. Hmm. Place like this, that's more a warning than a recommendation. What's your name? Sasha. Sasha what? Or maybe just skip right to telling me your real name. Place like this, Sasha will need to suffice. The other participants, who are they? Come to the Passiflora often? Seem to know everyone. I'm here from time to time. I cannot say all the faces are familiar, but that is Patrick Hazelnut. Never goes anywhere without those three. Met a man once who traveled with two Zeracanian warrior women as bodyguards, but those three... Have other talents, clearly. The halfling's Bernard Tully, a farmer, claims to play for pleasure. But everyone wants to win, don't they? Best beware of that one. He's not particularly fond of... Others, outcasts, types like you. Ironic, since Phineas himself is a half-elf. And I'm certain you've heard of Count Tybalt. After all, he is the one who organized this tournament. Actually, I haven't heard of him. He's reputed to be fabulously wealthy. I can't say how true it is, but he was able to afford his title and the county that came with it. All right, well, nice talking to you. Let's win this thing, Geralt. All right. See you later, Sasha. Try to chat up the other players before the tournament begins. We must all wait for Count Tybalt anyway. Oh, I can still just go upstairs? That's so silly. Okay. <laughs> what? Ma'am? We are here for Gwent, okay? Apologies, but I must focus my thoughts before the match. <laughs> yeah, no, I can see that. I can see that. This will certainly serve me better than your conversation with Sasha has served you. I'd be wary of her. Oh, all right. As long as they pay and don't hit. Hello, I'll naked girl. What's going on the over here with you, Bernard? I'm new to this too. Took me ages to squirrel away the coin for the buy-in. Mushrooms are no quick route to riches. <laughs> so you're really a farmer? You really a farmer? Why not look it? 
Got a little farmstead just outside the city. Could sit there for days just watching things grow. What's with the smell? The smell? Anywho, mushrooms are all well and good, but one's got to get away at times. My lady, she was in tears, said I'd get my throat slit in Novigrad. But I says to her, I says, Hortensia, what a chance. The best players, the rarest cards. She had to let me go. All right, well, good luck, dude. I feel bad for you because I'm going to kick your good ass. To but... you. Likewise. Now, that's the sporting spirit. Not like that half elf over there who's been shooting me murderous glares this whole time. <laughs> well, I'll go see him then, right? I'm sure, this will be interesting. Hello, Ooh. Cal Drogo. Black ones, Bedanians. What? Playing tournaments often? Small talk? And other such things? Playing tournaments often? What are to you? Perhaps you'd wish to see my cards as well. Am I a hee haw for you to fondle before you choose? Shall I wag my prick for you? See your cards when we play. You would likely to advance that far, mutant. Hee haw! Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to our closed Gwent tournament. By closed, I mean more than the mere elite nature of the event. Anyone leaving the Passiflora before the end of play will be disqualified. That's rule number one. Rules number two, three, and four are no fighting, dirty play, or magic tricks. We play for golden figurines. The winner will take them all along with a monetary prize equal to nine times the buy. Damn! Easy enough to calculate that nine have entered. The tournament will consist of three rounds. The finalist emerging from said shall play me. Players will be paired by random draw. The groupings for the first round shall be read now. Achoo! Phineas and Tim Knott. Sorry, Patrick Tim. Patrick Hazelnut and Harold Featherburn. Sorry, Harold. <laughs> Gervolt of Rivia and Bernard Tull. Ah, how about that? Bramble Frontenstock and Achoo! Madam Sasha. Excellent. A pleasant match to you all. Well, we know who's going to lose. <laughs> it's nice that they introduced those characters. Yeah. All right, Bernard. Oh, my goodness, buddy. I don't even know, friend. I don't even know. Let's do it. Starting at last. A year down the road, I'll be plying Hortensia and my lads with tales of this night. Let's play. He's so he's so happy and excited. And I just I feel I feel for him. I really do. Okay, Northern Kingdoms, let's win this damn thing. I will go first. Okay, we got that. We got... Ooh, that's looking good. Let's get rid of her. I'll take a spy. Mm. Uh, Sheila to Tanserville. We can do better. All right. Opening Gambit. Spy him. Let's grab two more. Ooh, another spy. Why, that is wonderful. Damn, he's going to spy on me. That's fine. I choose to spy on him. Oh, can I not use it? Uh, oh, because he's special. That's dicks. All right, well. Let's do this. Damn, it's just a spy. It's a game of spies right now. All the spies. All right. Well, that is certainly a thing that occurred. Let's do that then. I'll take the first round. Okay. Which means round two is going to be bonkers. Excellent. Excellent. Let's test the waters and drop, uh, actually, let's throw down her. We'll grab this dude, put him right back there, get two more, boop, wonderful. Oh my god, we're literally just mimicking each other's decks right now. All right. All right, I see how it is. Then let's um, put this guy right there. 
Take an early lead. See what he has. Wow, dude, this isn't even funny. This is this is getting borderline silly now. Okay, so then let's um put. Should I drop one of my tens now or wait? Let's put um. So I only have these there. Okay. Let's do uh, this dude, because he really serves no purpose except to sit there for now. So he's going to roll with a ballista. So he's not going to mess with the back line. My assumption is that he won't ruin it. Dude's dropping Triss Marigold. Fine. We'll do this. Let's see what he does now. If he can scorch it, that's bad news. <laughs> well, he used his, his ulti. That's fine, though, because then I can do this. Bring myself back up into the lead. Uh-huh. Let's go with this right here. Right, he's going to stripe up front. That's fine, because I got a strategy now. Bring her there. I'll bring this guy back. Well, well, well. Oh, shit. Dude is rolling with dragons and stuff? Okay, that's fine. Yennefer? I'm my own witch, man. Actually, I have two witches. How about them potatoes? That's 102. Scorch. Damn it. All right, well, he's using all of his scorches now, which is fine. Uh, That just means that we need to go up front with him. Back line. That's, that's okay. We'll do this. We'll put Dandelion in the front. That should make this real interesting. Yeah. Okay, I'm catching up now. Oh! Wow! He just wrecked his front line for that! Wow. All right. Interesting. Hmm. Let's escape. He's got three left. I have... This can go here, and that's going to make it, I mean, 10. That'll be 55. No, that'll be 50. And then maybe I can put her there, and that'll be 60, but I still won't have enough. So I might as well just surrender. But the problem is I just have this guy floating around. Which is silly. Uh, let's just space bar out. I'm hoping I can just get 30 and wreck him. Whoa, he's pulling Geralt! The Geralt of Rivia! Okay, that's fine. We'll take his best friend. Not really. One of his known associates. One of his other cards. Wow, okay. I don't think he has anything else. He has one card left. I have no idea what this could be. Wow, is that a tie? No, it's not! He loses! Oh, get wrecked! I had a lot of goof plays there, but I won. That's all that matters. We did it. Good. I'm going to pass to take the win. Sorry, dude. You almost beat me. That's a good enough story for the wife, I think, yeah? Congratulations. Bit of a shame being eliminated in the first round, but so it goes. It is only a game.
Having a good time. That's what matters. You're so positive, it's disgusting. I want you to know that. Ooh, I got full test. So, how did you fare in the first round? Not bad. Guessing you won too. I've the distinct impression my opponent was drunk. Had an altogether decent hand, but... Might have had a hard time concentrating. Hmm. Care to finish this conversation in private? I have a proposition for you. Meet on the terrace upstairs. Hmm. Fine. All right. <laughs> I don't know where this is leading, but she is pushing me to go. Meet Sasha oh. on the balcony. <laughs> I have a feeling she's up to no good, but I want to see what kind of no good she's up to. But the madam, well, so what's it gonna be? Still aim to get ten cases of SS for the I'd say so. You're not allowed to leave! Oh, Sasha's gonna push me off! Get the fuck out. I know exactly what's about to happen. You're not allowed to leave! Hmm, alone at last. What did you want to talk about? A cartload of coin. That's the grand prize, you know. I can't speak for you, but I'd prefer it didn't land in the wrong hands. And luck can be so undependable. Frankly, one should simply take the coin, subtly, you know, without bothering the others. I stand corrected. I did not expect this. Huh. As propositions go, this is not exactly what I was expecting. You don't seem like a... Thief? True, it's not my day job. Which is why I could use some help. Sure, okay. Why tell me? I'm a woman. I'm in need of that coin. And Geralt of Rivia would never abandon a woman in need. Or so I heard. Who'd you hear it from? Fringilla Vigo. She told me of your adventures in Beauclair. Apparently you're dependable. So long as the cause is just. Doesn't seem like a just cause to me. Doesn't seem like a just cause to me. What if I told you my life depended on it? Wouldn't believe you. Hmm, that changes things. Uh, let's figure out where this is going. Hmm, that changes things. Fine. Let's say I help you. I'll split the coin with you, of course. Split? What if I win the tournament? I shall have another proposition for you then. What's the plan? I shall tell you all when the time is right. For now, just stay alert. And if you are eliminated, stay till the tournament's end. It'll be worth your while, you'll see. All sounds pretty mysterious, but fine. Excellent. Now that's settled, let's rejoin the others. Trouble, lady. You are super trouble. I'm gonna go in before you because I don't want to get in trouble. Then he can get his wife out the dungeon. I'm not sure. I... What's the hurry, my prince? Lady, calm it down. I got stuff to do. Ah, uh, God. Time for round two. Your attention, please. Madam Sasha and Gilbert of Revia. Damn! They're making us Phineas play each other? and Harold Featherbuns. <laughs> we wish you a pleasant match. May fortune smile on you always. I'd give you a discount for heroic deeds, but the madam, well, you know. Black ones, the Danians. As long as they pay and don't hit. Just a bit more and I'll drop this job. Black ones, the Danians. As long as they pay and don't hit. Oh, 
going towards this. What's it gonna be? You still aim to get ten cases of SS for the feast. I get no pleasure whatsoever from easy victories. So I should be very angry if you let me win. Don't plan to. Curious about that other proposition, though. Oh my god, Geralt, you giant man whore! I like how everyone watching the series was like, oh, you bang Tristan off, you bang Yennefer, there's gonna be trouble. Oh, I'm very aware what happens, everyone spoiled it for me. But guys, at this point, I don't even care. This man will stick his wiener in anything. Anything and everything. He deserves what's coming to him. <laughs> oh my god. A minute ago he was like, I don't trust you. Now he's like, you're going to get plowed later tonight. All right. We got dandelion, some stripes. Oh my god. Some synergy up in this business. I guess we could try and get rid of this one and replace it with another. Let's do one more try. And we got Sheila. Okay, well, it's not what I wanted. What it'll do. Okay, um, let's drop Sheila and see what happens. Ooh, Triss Marigold right off the bat. Sork v Sork. Let's do another non-important one. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, what do you got? Let's do that. Commander's horn in the backfield. That's fine. I can do the exact. I can do the exact same thing. How's that look? Oh, better for you, actually. Hmm. Hmm. Let's drop these guys up front. Oh, my God. No, well, he's not getting buffed, so I feel good about this then. Again, unless she has a Scorch, in which case this is bad news bears. Ooh, Archer. He aims for the knee always. What a dick. All right, then we Dandelion up front. D, go to it. Bing. Back in the lead. We're just dumping all of our cards right now. Oh, my God. Where's that going? 67, 67. Uh, I'm going to... Drop her right there. 77. Bring it. Bring it to the party, lady. Bring it to the party, lady. Damn. Okay. My turn. I'm going to pass. Take that win. Oh, yes. Okay. Northern Realms faction ability triggered. You got some awesome shit, bro. Which is actually the perfect thing to get. And then let's bring out Dandelion. That's not what I wanted, actually. <laughs> well, wieners. I could have picked a million things that were better than that. Um, I say we forfeit. Go in with three, call it a day, right? I goofed. I made a mistake. Regroup. Oh, oh, girl's pulling one out. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. So that gives me another chance to not screw this up. Okay. Let's see what she does. Yen's going in. She's going to summon someone else. That's cool. There's that 10. She has one card. That's another summon. So uh, let's put this guy here. We'll put it all on her to figure out what I need. There's that guy. He's going to bring in two, a 10. So 28 is what I need to beat. So 
Let's do this. Bing, that's 20. Then we'll do this little lady right here. It's 25. And just, just so we can shut it down. Put it to an end. There we go. GG. Hmm. Well, I hope your luck holds. <laughs> Geralt. You old, dirty bastard. Ladies and gentlemen, the third round. The heat is on. The nearest round's winner will face Count Tybalt himself in the final. <coughs> Phineas and Gerard of Rivia. Achoo! I'll not play a mutant. Are we to understand you forfeit this round? Fine. In that case... No. I'm not swiving forfeit the round. I shall squash him like a louse. A good match to you both. Please remember the tournament rules. No magic, no quarrels. Mm -hmm. If you just want to settle this with fisticuffs, Play. man... I can do that too. Okay, so speaking of which, I have destroy your enemy's strongest siege units. Vulnerability. No, you know what? I'm good with what I have. All right, I think I think I just have a great deck right now. An incredibly good deck is one you do not turn your back on. Dijkstra, my man. Let's get rid of you, Kira. You're wonderful, but I'll take another blue stripe. Sheila. Hmm. Hmm. Ooh. Ooh. We're going spy school on this one. Okay. That elf looks badass. Like, he don't take shits. Uh, but does he take the help of spies? Boop. Great. Wow, you're going to pass on me like that? Okay, good. <laughs> good, you do that. I hope you enjoy this victory. Thanks. Thanks for that, pal. Wow, you actually, can I beat him with Can I actually beat him this round? I don't think that's possible, or that I should, but could I, though? Could I if I wanted to? Could I drop a 10 and one of these in the backfield and just beat him and have all these other guys ready for major plays? Or could I take an 8? Mm, that's dumb. Take an 8, put it here, throw this down. Um, what the hell? Let's do it. Yeah, how about that, potatoes? Yes, excellent. My, my turn? Okay, let's start in the backfield and see what damage we can cause, right? Ooh, Yorvith. That's not cool. We have a bit of pass, T and I. Oh, that's how you want to roll. Right there, son. Right there, son. Mortal enemies on the battlefield. Go! All right, I see how you're playing. Well, I can play ridiculously, too. How about that? No Scorch. Zero Scorch. No Scorch. Fuck. I mean, good news is he may not have another, right? Let's do this guy here. See what else he does. Oh. All right. Well, there goes any attempt at a front line. Although, can I just drop him up here and... Or I put him right here and that takes me to 21. See what else he has in there. And there go friends. 
and he brings in friends who immediately fall down to one. All right, well, you know, sometimes weird stuff like that happens. Let's go right here. 27. You're going to F up the field, man. Let's see what you got. Going to heal someone, going to bring someone in. As a one, he's going to get two more cards. But I'm still ahead. So whatever, yo. Uh, I will see your spy and raise you a spy. I can play this game too. Oh my god. Jackpot right there. Wow. Commander's Horn. You really want this one. Who am I to tell you otherwise, pal? Who am I to tell you otherwise? I could drop this guy there, take him to 37. That'd be ridiculous. Uh, but you know what? Let's... Um... Hmm. Man, I really just want to F with this guy so badly. What do I have back here? So I could drop her and get an 8, put him in the back line? F it. Why not? Why not? Let's have some fun. This elf thinks he's better than me. Get out of here, elf. How about them? Potatoes. Oh. He has me. I'm honored. All right. Well, that occurred. Let's, uh... I can put him down there, right? Uh, let's just pass. He's only got two cards, so one of them's Triss, which is great. But that's... You know, that's his problem, because I'm about to go crazy on him. And Scorch. Wow, dude. Alright, this is how I win. I don't even need to do this. Look at this perfect setup right here. All I have to do is this. Alright, thanks for the win. You weren't even that tough, man. The mutant cheated. I'll gouge those devilish eyes out with my bare hands. Bro, he said don't fight. I told mm. mm. Whoa! Whoa! Going down, you son of a bitch. There we go. Oh my god. Well played. Congratulations on both your victories. I'd wanted to summon the guards initially, but... Uh... Yeah, it's better I took care of it. Please, join me for the final. I must admit I did not expect this outcome. There's a rather large sum on another player, in fact. Might have guessed there were multiple games going on. Let's do this! The final one! Madam uh, Sasha, you gonna... Let's begin. Always, always with you, full test. Dude's rolling with monsters. Okay. Um, this is a wild deck. Let's get rid of this. All right, I'll take it. It's so weird. What a crazy ass deck.
Here's hoping this gets some results. Dandelion's going first. Okay. Well, con congrats. Gonna pull that out. Maybe send them my way? I don't know. Okay, let's put in uh, one of my tens first, right? Let's, let's see what happens. Actually, let's put in this guy because I can call him back later. I can't call back the tens later, so we'll put him here. Whoa! Okay. Um, then we can... He's already at 10, which is ridiculous. Then we could, I suppose, pull these two guys in, drop this horn, use her and her to bring them back, and do it again with this guy. Which kind of makes Dandelion useless, so we might as well use him now, right? Alright. We're in. Do this. Wow, all right. Interesting. If I use this now, I can still use my plan and only have to use one of these, so let's use it. Why not? 26, I'll take that round. Thanks a whole bunch. He gets to keep a guy on there, too, and it's going to be Dandelion. So no matter what he puts in the front line, it's going to be super powerful now. But I get another card, so... Good on me. Let's go with my strategy that I had of bring her into here. that front line oh my god Woo! lord okay so it's gonna be his front versus my back that's not that's not necessarily a g mm, mm. My damn elves giving him cards okay He has more cards. Delightful. But I have the lead, so this is a problem for him. And I'm going to drop this in the backfield. Still not enough, my friend. Still not enough. Um, Let's go with her here. Let's put someone else on the field. Um, hmm. Dandelion can buff Dixtra, so let's do that. It's 103. What do you got, man? What do you got? Give me something. You got four cards left. Geralt, okay. I see your Witcher and raise you a Witcher of my own. Get him, Siri. Oh my god, this is for all the potatoes in Potato Town right here. All right. I'm so eager to see what he has. Like, this is crazy. Oh my god. Whoa! All right, and clear weather. So I win, no matter what. Hey! Give me that money, 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 money. Awesome. 
superb match. A great pleasure. The prize will be yours. Faith! The coin's gone. The guard's been stabbed. What? How is this possible? No one's removed the coin from the premises. All those leaving were searched. Phew! We must scour the building. Anyone leaving must pass inspection. She did not steal it. Yo, Sasha? Um, ma'am? Before you ask, it wasn't me. Figured as much. An unexpected turn of events, but our agreement stands. We must try to recover the coin together. Oh, agreed. Agreed. Where do we start? We must get upstairs. Wait. I say, this witcher is Captain Hansen's good friend. He could examine the crime scene. Charge only a trifling. A fee? But... We will, of course, collect it from the captain personally. How is his injury from the other week? Has it healed yet? Well, I did it. Splendid. We shall go upstairs at once. Mm hmm Okay. Upstairs we go. Oh, the guard to the crime scene. Well, what's your sense of this business? Oh, where all these guards were earlier? The guards who could have helped when that fight broke out? Get out of town. Uh, ne next time we see the captain, milady, I'd um, appreciate your mention. That is all, good fellow. You may go. The Witcher requires absolute silence while he works. Of uh, course. That went well. Really know the captain? Yes, a horrid man. Come now, get to work. Knock his shoes right off. Okay. Guy is bloody and nasty, and we'll take a look at him. Blows delivered from a strange angle. Expert, though. Precise. Anything over there? No. Before I look at that, is there anything back here? Nope, a whole bunch of nothing. Okay, so it's that and this. Somebody dragged something heavy towards the terrace. What am I looking for over here? Oh, shit. Crossbow bolt. A line tied to it. Line's clearly been cut. Thief might have used it to lower the sack of coin. He'd need an accomplice waiting down below to grab it. Hmm. Something down there, but I can't make it out. Must have been one of the players. Lowered the coin down on the line, then strolled past the guards. Hmm. This was well prepared. Think you can track the culprit down? Don't know yet. I'll look in the street, see if I can find anything there. You know who it was? That Come on. son of a bitch halfling. The one who was all like, oh no, good sport and whatnot. The reason why I was so happy because he knew he was going to steal the money anyway. He paid to get in here. Oh, get out of town. Alright, let's go find his butt. I guarantee that's who did it. have over here. Oh, right there. Same as the one tied to the bolt. Gonna have to look around. Where's that scent coming from? Cinnamon. Strange. Was that the scent on the I'm halfling? The right, guys. Remember when he was like, what was that scent? I thought maybe he was talking about shit because he farmed mushrooms. But what if it was cinnamon that he detected? Oh, I'm gonna find this son of a bitch. I know it has to be him. I highly recommend you visit. Did I lose the scent? Uh oh. Haste makes waste. Culprit lost this crate. 
Must have fallen off the wagon. Can you be certain this was the thief's? Uh, I know. Crossbow under the packages. <laughs> Itching to crack a pun about every rosemary having its. I appreciate you resisting the impulse. Mm, I've seen this guild mark. It's a trading company's. One that imports spices from Zeracania. They have a storehouse at the docks. Northernmost one on this side of the port. Shall I meet you there? Sounds good. Look, I just want this damn money. <laughs> I just want this damn money. Alright, so we're going all the way down here. Is there a faster way to get there? You'll see. Ranovid will move Redania's capital to Novigrad. Every time I hear something this So he probably wasn't a mushroom farmer. Instead, he was, like, part of this guild. And, all right. All right. I see where this is going. My child's fallen ill. See the empty ship in mm -hmm. yeah, No one knows how. Oh, my mummy says hello. There are six inside. I wasn't able to get the door open. Gotta find another way in then. Okay. So we're looking at something like not this, right? Locked. Perhaps we climb up here and then make our way now. Although, perhaps this way is the way to go. Here we go. There they are. Well, hey there, halfling. I should have known. Which one's Hortensia? The tall one. Masquerade's done, Tully. Give us the coin. Masquerade? <laughs> well put. Been watching you from the start, sweetheart. Though I ought to admit, I thought you'd follow me alone. Told him who you are yet? No? I'm sure he'd love to hear it. Go on, tell him. Or I'll tell Hortensia to break your fingers. What is he talking about? Release her. Oh, I need this. What's this about? It's about Madame Sasha swallowing my mushroom farming nonsense hook, line, and sinker when she should have been more vigilant. So, will you tell him who you spy for? Or would you rather scream it out? Damn. Let go of her. Step away. One of you restrain him. Then make sure he gets a good view. Nope. Nope, gents. I feel, I feel, I feel for you guys. I do. We'll let those guys burn a little bit. Looks like she got her kills in. Damn. Oh, good work. I did not, in fact, suspect him, whereas he clearly caught on to me long ago. Halflings can be unpredictable. At any rate, we've succeeded. Now to divide the coin. Oh, yeah. So what's this proposition that's supposed to convince me to share my winnings? No longer on the table. We retrieve the coin together. We shall divide it equally. Know what? 
Let's have dinner at the Kingfisher. My treat to celebrate my last day in Novigrad. Returning to Nilfgaard? Damn. Heading back to Nilfgaard? That why you needed the coin? I see you miss very little. Still got a touch of an accent. Ah oh, well. It seems I shall need a new trait. Anyway, I'm compromised in Novigrad, so... Eh. Who were you before you became a spy? I don't rightly remember anymore. But I suppose you can call me Cantarella. That your real name? Well, almost. Invitation accepted. I'd love to. As it turned out, the blue-eyed prostitute was actually his sister. He couldn't believe it. Oh, my. He asked me to see her again at the House of the Night, and then... Fascinating story. Shall we go upstairs? You can show me exactly how it ended. Oh, Geralt. Why not? <laughs> Great idea. put in a lot of work to get that dress off. my problem that is the exact same sex scene he just had with Triss a little bit ago hmm. slipped away without really a as far as I can tell Geralt is like a one trick pony one trick one trick unicorn he has got a few moves and he uses them on everyone he's not open to experimentation when you sleep with Geralt you sleep with him that way that's how you get it that's how you get it. that's what he's known for when women talk about him that's what they talk about it's gonna take about 36 seconds this will be a lot of cuts and flashes, and that's about it. You won't remember it, and you'll want to leave in the morning. Geralt, forgive me for leaving without saying farewell, but you were sleeping so peacefully. Almost made me want to nick your cards and coin, or at least read all those letters you carry around in your pockets. Old habits die hard. Till our next meeting, then. Perhaps one day soon I'll see to it that we bump into each other completely by accident. Cantarella. I have 19,000 gold in my pocket, and I'm going to steal more. <laughs> I don't even give shits. I'm taking it. I'm taking mugs. I'm taking everything I can take. Raspberry juice. Damn right. An apple? Sure. Why not? I'm the Witcher. I give no shits. I'm walking around in boxers. UFO Commander, we are the future. We're going to take you to the future. Then we're going to get... To the future, where everyone talks like they're from the future. UFO Commander, we are the future. We're gonna take you to the future. Then we're gonna get to the future, where everyone talks like they're from the future. Hello, our old star. Space just got to number one out of the plan. The main space, the tip top shape, I'm swell shape. And I'm gonna make a fortune for my ass for Shut the balls up! UFO Commander, we are the future. We're gonna take you to the future. Then we're gonna get to the future, where everyone talks like they're from. Shut the balls up! UFO Commander. We are the future. We're gonna take you to the future. Then we're gonna get to the future. Everyone talks like they're from. Shut the balls up! Give me that! No! 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 <laughs>